Hi, thank you for clicking on this video and good to have you here today. Happy New Year to you once again. On our bill of fare today, we are preparing squid and we are going to fry it. You will love this recipe. It is very, very easy and simple. Thank you, my returning subscribers, for always watching my videos, sharing to others, and leaving me comments. I do appreciate it. Okay. So, um, I brought you how to clean the squid, and the video link will be in the comment section. And please, you can check it out on the page or on the channel as well. Thank you so much. If today is the first time here, nice to meet you. This is Lena and welcome. Please do not hesitate to subscribe or follow for more videos. And please do not make it the, uh, the first and the last time of visiting. <laughs> Thank you so much. So as I said earlier, I brought you how to clean the squid and we are not going back to do that again so this is how we are going to cut it okay you can cut it um according to any size that you want and this is what we are going for today so we are done with everything i will just go ahead and pour this in my basket and this is how it looks okay so i will go ahead and clean it very well as i said earlier we've done and we have a video for that this is how it looks so i'm just going to take the one we are going to prepare and i've prepared my solution for it okay and the solution is some water i have my all purpose seasoning the all purpose seasoning okay contains salt pepper ginger garlic black pepper and so on okay so because of that i'm not going to add any salt to it with squid you have to be very very careful with the salt you just need small salt okay if you are not going to use any all purpose seasoning you need just small salt so i'm just going to taste and see if the salt is okay so i will just dip my hand in it and taste for salt if you can't do it please just gauge it okay but you don't need more salt but enough salt just small okay yes i am used to tasting the salt like that because i used to sell fish and that is how we used to taste it okay i'm i'm okay with that now you make sure the liquid drain from the squid before you fry it, or you let it stay in the basket for some time else you are going to see that okay you are going to give yourself some work after <laughs> you are done preparing the squid so i had a lot of liquid in there that is why it is looking like that so when it is ready we are going to see only oil okay i mean only oil not olive oil <laughs> yeah you are going to see only oil and it, you are not going to see it like this that is what i meant <laughs> that is just by the way are you still with me if yes please have you subscribed have you shared have you followed if not can you please do so for me as i said earlier it is free okay uh -huh. so please don't be confused we are not preparing soup it, it is because um it contains a lot of water that's why it has become like this and when it is ready we are going to see only only oil <laughs> just by the way so after some few uh, minutes like 20 minutes this is how it looks you can see that it is going down and we are beginning to see the oil do you get it yes so with this recipe we are going to fry it um very dry we didn't want it dry to be honest with you but i ended up frying it very dry for a reason which i will share with you so this is the reason can you see that foamy thing you're seeing uh -huh. it is very very dangerous or very risky so please be watchful if you see something like that i have not seen this before um this is the first time i'm seeing this 
whilst i'm preparing squid okay so this is what i did so that it does not pour in the oil because as i told you earlier i used to sell fish we used to fry fish so uh, at least i have the techniques <laughs> so that is what i use here so that the oil will not pour in the fire so be very careful if you experience this now as you can see the foam the foamy thing is down and now we can see only oil okay not olive oil <laughs> it sounded like that <laughs> you can see only oil okay and yes our squid is ready but i wanted it a bit dry which the other people <laughs> wanted it soft so with this squid i enjoyed it as <laughs> than them <laughs> now our squid is ready this was very simple and please remember you don't add a lot of salt thank you for watching